everyone, I'm Monica Rana. This is Imashu 365 and you're watching Hilkos News Channel. Let's start with the headlines. Nine tourists killed in Kinnor landslide. Doctor killed in Himachal's Kinnor landslide had tweeted happy pictures from tragedy location a day before. Prime Minister Narendra Modi announced his rupees 2 lakh for kin of diseased that died in Kinnor landslide. Tharamshala landslide displaced slum dwellers and laborers given shelter. India reports 39,361 new COVID cases, 416 more deaths. Narendra Modi pays review to Cargill martyrs on Vijay Divas. Rahul Gandhi writes tractor to parliament to protest against farm laws. B.S. Yedurappa resigns as Karnataka's chief minister. President Ramnath Kovind's Dras visit on Vijay Divas cancelled due to bad weather. All women Kisan Sansad at Jantar Mantra in protest against farm laws. Now news in detail. Nine tourists killed in Kinnor landslide in Himachal Pradesh. Shooting boulders triggered by a landslide hit a tourist vehicle near Batseri, 8 km from Sangla in Kinnor district, killing nine persons on Sunday afternoon. The vehicle, a tempo traveller carrying 11 persons, was passing through the spot where the rolling stones fell. While eight persons died on the spot, one succumbed to injuries on way to hospital. Three others, including a pedestrian, sustained injuries. The disease were identified as Maya Devi Banyani, 55-year-old, her son Anurag Biyani, 31-year-old, and daughter Richa Biyani, 35-year-old, all of a Sikh Rajasthan. Driver Umrav Singh, 42-year-old of Delhi, Pratiksha Sunil Patil, 27-year-old of Maharashtra, Deepa Sharma, 34-year-old of Rajasthan, Amok Bapa, 27-year-old and Satish Katakwa, 34-year-old of Chhattisgarh and Kumar Ulhas, 37-year-old. The injured Shiril Oberoi, 39-year-old of Delhi, Naveen Bhardwaj, 37-year-old of Mohali and Ranjit Singh, 45-year-old of Kinnor district were under treatment at Community Health Centre Sangla. Video clips of the incident which surfaced on social media showed a bridge over the Baspa River collapsing after being hit by boulders. A house and some other vehicles were also damaged. Saju Ram Rana SP Kinnor said the tourists had hired the vehicle on a sharing basis and they were on their way to Chitkul from Sangla. Rescue teams reached the spot but stones were still rolling down, hampering operations. Chief Minister Jairam Thakur expressed grief over the incident and directed the administration to ensure immediate relief to the affected people. Dr. Kildin Himachal's Kinnor landslide had tweeted happy pictures from tragedy location a day before. Least did she know that this will be the place where her journey would end. A doctor killed in Himachal Pradesh Kinnor landslide had tweeted happy pictures a day before from the bridge location where the tragedy took place. Dr. Deepa Sharma wrote, life was nothing without mother nature. The Jaipur doctor's Twitter is full of photographs from her Kinnor trip, including a stunning early morning sky and the last point of India where civilians are allowed. Meanwhile, actor Kangana Ranaut mourned the loss of Dr. Deepa calling her a fan and claiming that she had visited her house in Manali and used to send her gifts and write letters. Prime Minister Narendra Modi announces rupees 2 lakh for kin of disease that died in Kinnor landslide. President Ramnath Kovind and Prime Minister Narendra Modi have expressed condolences over the death of people due to landslide in Kinnor district of Himachal Pradesh. Narendra Modi has announced an ex gratia of rupees 2 lakh each for the next of kin of the disease and rupees 50,000 to the injured from the Prime Minister's National Relief Fund. Meanwhile, President Ramnath Kovind tweeted, deeply saddened by the news of deaths due to landslide in Kinnor, Himachal Pradesh. I express my deepest condolences to the bereaved families and wish the injured people a speedy recovery. Dharamshala landslide displaced slum dwellers and laborers given shelter. The district administration of Kangra has allotted land to slum dwellers who were displaced after their temporary habitations were destroyed in flash flood on July 12 in Sara village. The orders in this regard has been issued by SDM Dharamshala Harish Gaju. In the orders, it has been stated that a temporary relief camp has been set up for 59 families of migrant laborers who had been settled in Dharamshala area for more than 50 years. 
15 families of local people will be housed in government senior secondary school Bugley while 137 children who had been rendered homeless due to flash floods were rehabilitated in school premises of Tonglan Charitable Trust and Tonglan Office. The order states that since the schools would start functioning from July 26 on a temporary basis, all those displaced would now be accommodated on government land in village Sara near Dharamshala. India reports 39,361 new COVID cases, 416 more deaths. India saw a single day rise of 39,361 coronavirus infections, taking the total tally of COVID cases to 3 crore 14 lakh 11,262. While the daily positivity rate was recorded above 3 percent after 35 days, according to the Union Health Ministry data updated on Monday, the COVID death toll rose to 4 lakh 20,967, with 416 more fatalities. The ministry said the active cases have increased to 4 lakh 11,189 and comprise 1.31 percent of the total infections, and the national COVID recovery rate was recorded at 97.35 percent. The data showed. Narendra Modi pays tribute to Kargil martyrs on Vijay Divas. Paying tributes to the soldiers who made the supreme sacrifice in the Kargil war, Prime Minister Narendra Modi on Monday said their bravery motivates us every single day. On the 22nd anniversary of the Kargil Vijay Divas, which marks India's victory over Pakistan in the war, Modi said the country remembers the sacrifice and valor of its soldiers. He tweeted, we remember their sacrifices, we remember their valor. Today on Kargil Vijay Divas, we pay homage to all those who lost their lives in Kargil protecting our nation. Their bravery motivates us every single day. Rahul Gandhi rides tractor to parliament to protest against farm laws. Congress leaders on Monday protested against farm laws both inside and outside parliament with Rahul Gandhi leading a tractor protest outside. Rahul Gandhi rode a tractor to parliament to make a point against farm legislation. He was accompanied by Punjab Congress MPs and Rajya Sabha MP Dipinder Singh Huda. These laws are of a few industrialists, not for farmers. The government says nothing bad has happened to the farmers and that the farmers sitting outside on protests are terrorists. But the fact is that the laws are not for the farmers. They are for a few industrialists, Rahul Gandhi told reporters before several Congress leaders including Randeep Surajwala and Youth Congress President V.V. Srinivas were taken into preventive custody by Delhi police for violating Section 1. 144 of the CRPC outside parliament. The Congress MPs also move adjournment notices in the Lok Sabha demanding reappeal of farm laws and a discussion on farmer issues. Shiromani Akali Dal's Har Simrat Badal and AAP MP Bhagwant Man also moved similar notices. B.S. Yedurappa resigns as Karnataka's chief minister. Ending days of speculation, Karnataka's Chief Minister B.S. Yedurappa on Monday resigned from the position after making an emotional speech at a function to mark two years of his government in the Bidhana Sodha. I have decided to resign. I will meet the governor after lunch. The 78-year-old CM said as he talked of various challenges, he overcame to reach where he had and also during his tenure, which incidentally he was not able to complete even this time. Meanwhile, all eyes are now on the BJP's choice to replace Yedurappa, a popular mass leader in his own right. Several prominent names are doing the rounds, but it remains to be seen who will be the next CM to take over from the Lingayat strongman. President Ramnath Kovind's Dras visit on Vijay Divas cancelled due to bad weather. Bad weather on Monday forced the cancellation of President Ramnath Kovind's visit to Dras in Ladakh to pay homage to martyrs on the 22nd anniversary of the Kargil Vijay Divas. Officials said it is for the second time in three years that the president could not fly to Dras for the Kargil Vijay Divas celebration. Officials said that the president's flight could not take off to Dras due to bad weather. All women Kisan Sansad at Jantar Mantra in protest against farm laws. All women team of protesters began the Kisan Sansad, that is, farmers of parliament at the Jantar Mantra on Monday as the agitation against the three central farm laws enter its eight months. 
द संयुक्ता किसान मोर्चा अ कलेक्टिव ऑफ ओवर 40 प्रोटेस्टिंग फार्मर्स यूनियंस द महिला किसान संसद विल रिफ्लेक्ट द की रोल दैट वेमेन प्ले इन इंडियन एग्रीकल्चर and its critical role in the ongoing movement a protester said this would be the first time women will independently run parliament that is kisan sansad so this is all for this time stay connected and keep watching hilquest your channel thank you